What's going on, guys? You know, I was sitting here thinking, you know, we, you know, we keep saying there's not sides or should be sides, but there clearly are sides. And now it's like, if the sides you're on, just really think about this. I, I was watching shit last night, and I see nothing but a bunch of fucking people just bragging and laughing and having a great time about taking down channels. And fucking morons, too. I mean, did you hear Reese? I mean, he was like, Flex had it all wrong when I struck his channel. Uh, he said that his main channel. He, Flex never said a channel name. He said Reese gave me the strike. It don't matter which fucking channel you done it for. I mean, <laughs> like that would even fucking matter. It's like, oh, I did it for my other channel. So that makes it better. But it was still you, Reese. Both them channels, you know, they belong to you. You're the one that, get, you know, gave the strikes. And come to find out, it wasn't even uh, Reese on this last one on Heidi that gave the warning. It was freaking Cherry. Cherry, think about it. The guy who's threatening her has said the shit he has said about her. I mean, threatened violent shit. I mean, he can say, oh, whatever. When you threaten to kill somebody, that's, that's violent. But he's threatening that kind of shit. And he, he warns her. Then you got like Reese. He's doing shit from three years ago that he's editing and chopping up to make it look like she's something she's not. Which, again, you know, 100% she didn't do any of that shit. But even if she did, it don't fucking matter. It's got nothing to do with YouTube. It's nobody's fucking business. That ain't got nothing to do with anything. You're, I mean, that's something that, you know, everybody talks about stuff behind the scenes and Discord and all that shit going on. Hell, they, they're sitting there telling you right to your face that they talk behind the scenes. I mean, look at all this shit that comes out. Everybody knows what they're doing. I mean, it, it's it's amazing. And if you look in the chat last night, Necros, there's only a couple people left that'll fucking be seen around them fucking weirdos. And they're weirdos, too. I mean, you got the one chick who lied her ass off and sat there and said, Oh, Cherry didn't bother me, but uh, somebody you know released something that proved... Everything you said was bullshit. So even when you're over there telling them that shit, like, it didn't bother me. They know it's a lie. They read it. They read your own words. They see you're full of shit. You did care. And, you know, we got the people who, you know, used to, we'd go, you know, they'd go both places. They would type in the chat, like, here and there. But see, when you do that, you're, you're okay in what they do. Even if you're not saying it. Even if you don't go over there and say, like, hey, I'm, uh, you know, I support what you're doing. If you even say the opposite. If you, even if you say, I don't support what you're doing. Just by you being there and typing in the chat or sitting there watching it, you're supporting it. Because why, why would they stop doing what they do if people are still coming there? Even if somebody comes and says, oh, man, that was a terrible thing you did. Then that's all that happens and you're still in the chat. Type, you know, they don't give a fuck. I mean, look at Jerry. He's, he's been he's led away with shit for so long. He's got away with it. That now he just feels like he's empowered, but he's fucked up now. See, Cherry, you, you, now you're going to see what shit happens. And this ain't a threat or anything. This is facts. You're the one that you can't go live. You're on, he was on Necro's channel last night making threats, saying shit that I guarantee he will not say on his own channel. That's, that's how stupid you are, Alex. You're going to sit there and let the dude say shit on your channel and get you taken down. And... He, I, watch when he comes back he will not say any of that on his channel because he don't want to lose his monetization again then he blames people for that but you know Roy I thought you know he was sitting there saying take accountability take account so when Flex does something and he says like you know it's violating TOS that's what you get but when Cherry goes on the rant saying people took down his mind ain't that his own fault they couldn't have done it unless he said the shit he said I mean you can't say that I mean what really needs to be done is the NGB shit when Cherry done that. That's what's going to be, you know, that's going to look real good for you, Cherry, when it gets around, you know, your area with the shit you said about people. Like I said, man, you fucked around too much this time. You, you, you went around, you done shit. Now you got people, you fucked with people that you shouldn't have fucked with. And now you'll see. I mean, it's not, like I said, no threat. It's just now every little time you fuck up, Cherry, every time you threaten somebody, every time you say something racist, every time you play racist music on shit, now you know you'll 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 see what happens. It's again, it's the people who go over there and support it and type in the chats and say all that shit and just sit there, and even though if they're talking about something else in the chats talking about some again, you're still supporting it, you're still there, you're telling them it's okay. I mean, you've seen Roy in there, you know, he's having the time of it, he doesn't give a fuck. He's I mean, again, you know, I I was told by several people like, you know, 
what kind of person he was. And I knew, I knew you couldn't be, you know, he couldn't be trusted. You couldn't trust his ass, and he was a terrible person. I mean, that's fucking obvious. He's a piece of shit. But I really didn't think he would fuck Fleck. Because if you think about it, what did he say that uh, a while back that he, he mentioned me and Flex by per and said, they're trying to take money out of my pockets. And the funniest thing about that is we, we're the ones that put money in his fucking pockets. Yeah, Roy, you didn't, I mean, what the fuck are you talking about? No one, no one ever told people back then, ever said anybody, just stay away from your channel. Matter of fact, we stupidly did the opposite. We would tell people like, oh yeah, Jack, you know, no, you're fine. We would see people over there chat. Now, some of them, did, they did say, you know, kind of neutral. But now we're past that. Now, if you go over there and type, I mean, and, and to me, you should just fucking stay over there. If that's the kind of people you want to be with, go over there and be with them. You shouldn't be allowed to fucking go over there with the trash, then try to come back and like, stand and be like, oh yeah, you know, what they're doing is terrible, but then go over there and support it. So if that's the people you want to be with, go fucking do it. Then when you get fucked over, don't come fucking crying. That's the problem. Every time someone fucks them over over there, they'll come running back, you know, and then, again, they do it because at first they're all tore up about it, but then when, like, we finally stand up for people, the other side sees it, especially Cherry, then what he'll do is he'll kind of try to, you know, kiss up to him a little bit to make him think then because they're so fucking scared of that fucking pussy. I have no idea why. I really don't. The man is a nobody. He's a nothing. He's a fucking loser. And you guys will sit there and worry about that fucking guy says about you. Who gives a fuck? Fuck him. Fuck him and everybody that fucking even has anything to do with him online, offline, or anywhere. Fuck him. That's the problem. When you sit there and say he's a different person offline, no, he's not. He's a fucking dick. He's a cocksucker. He, he ruins shit. He's manipulative. He threatens people. He goes after families. The shit Jerry does, the shit he done to Thunder alone, should make people see. I mean, think about it. He cried for fucking nearly two years now about fucking Red because she said a name. This motherfucker is tagging people that's not even fucking having anything to do with it. It's never said a word. Going after them, trying to ruin real lives, taking people off, of, you know, and, and, and sitting there, like, bragging about, like, ha-ha, I got rid of Thunder. I got rid of this person. You ain't get rid of nobody, motherfucker. You ain't doing shit. I mean, I'm telling you, dude, you're, you're pushing it. I mean, you are at that fucking point where, I mean, the people sit up there and talk like you got Jackie and Clark, them fucking weirdos in the chat, Tracy. Yeah, we see what they are. They're fucking nobodies. They're nothing. They're idiots. And we see it. And, I, again, that's how bad that side is. She said none of that shit Cherry did bother her. Then Jen showed where she had said it did bother her very much. And instead, and the reason Jen done that, you know, this ain't taken up for Jen. This is just the, the truth. The reason Jen done that is because when uh, Jen, well, a lot of us was saying like, no, 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 you know, you was really tore up about that. And she's like, no, it didn't bother me at all. So you, she was calling Jen a liar, you know, more or less, you know, like everything she's saying, like, oh, no, that's a lie. So why wouldn't Jen show that to be like, yes, you did. Yes, you did say that. I mean, it'd be different if you just shut up and didn't say nothing, but you called her a liar by saying, oh, no, that happened. And when Jen said it, you know, just saying every time she said it, it's like, no, I don't know, you know, I didn't care. It didn't bother me at all. You're a fucking, you're a terrible person. Any, I mean, think about, I don't even fuck her. I ain't gonna talk about her ass no more. She's fucking irrelevant. I don't give a shit. She, the shit she types and saying people's talk. I mean, she's a fucking weird fucking... All them people, they deserve each other. Roy, you need to fucking keep your ass over there. I mean, now you ain't got a fucking choice. Flex is finally fucking seen on your ass. I mean, it's, it's every time he's let you around, you fucked him. Then you will always... Going back to a long time ago, you will always get the people... That's like what's always Reese. Reese, Cherry, and a few others... You, He'll get those people and let them come up and just fucking trash the fuck out of Flex and sit back and fucking laugh on his fucking goofy ass. I mean, I don't see how y'all forgive him as many times as you did. I, I mean, I kind of feign getting along with him just to keep the peace, but he's a fucking dick. I'm telling you all, man, if you, I mean, it, it's going past the point now. The shit they done to Thunder, I ain't going to say they ain't cherry. Reese is a, like I said, again, Reese is a, he's a terrible person. He's not a smart guy saying that when Flex, Flex never said, go back and watch, he never said a channel name. He said, Reese flagged my new channel too, and it all happened. You can listen to Reese sit there and say, well, you know, when Roy gave that strike, as soon as he done that, he's been waiting. He's held them, he knew for all that time. I mean, fuck, YouTube should hear about that. The dude sitting there watching, knowing the shit's there, and waits till he gets a strike so he can throw him two more. 
But that's kind of a lie, though. You can tell where Cherry's, you know, set that shit up. Because if you really think about it, Flex has had strikes before, but Reese never done it. It's just right now, all, all the Cherry stuff. I mean, you guys, I mean, the ones, anybody that has anything to do with Cherry, you should be fucking, I mean, a shame like Cherry. What did he say? He, uh, what, what did he say? $14,000 or something like that he lost? Get the fuck out of here, man. Oh, I got other channels connected to this AdSense. No, you don't. Yeah, you might, but, you, I mean, no one's watching that shit either. I mean, it's crazy. I, 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 like, Torp, if you hear this shit, you sit there and talk about the drama stuff and all this shit like this, and, you, like, this ain't something you can fence right about and jump back and forth. What they done's fucking terrible. Going after people in real life, Torp, you know how that is. You know what happened, you know what happened when people went in your long time ago, you know, somebody lost a job, you know, over a bunch of lies they made up about you, Torp. Well, see, that's the same thing Jerry's trying to do. It's not, I mean, it's not working. No one's going to fucking, no one cares about his ass. He's to the point of fucking harassment now. See, they, when Roy did that thing saying, we own, are, are you fucking crazy? No one sits around thinking about ways to take you guys down, ways to do this. That's what you guys, we own you. You thought you shut down Flex. Nothing changed. I mean, the monetization thing changed. Flex don't care about it. It doesn't matter anyway. That channel will be monetized for long anyway. But nothing has changed. If you go in that, the lounge, it looks like the lounge. You, you did All you done was show what kind of fucking people you are. And you literally, this is shit you can't come back from. I mean, no, this ain't something like Roy done a long time ago and he comes back like, oh, laughing and going on. Fuck him. Fuck Cherry. Fuck Reese. All those people. And that ain't, this ain't against YouTube TOS. I'm allowed to have my fucking opinion. I ain't threatening nobody. I'm just saying, literally, when you do shit now, and you, you you violate TOS, which Cherry can't you know go on a channel without violating. But I bet she's very careful on his channel. Y'all need to y'all need to watch that Hector and Alex. You guys need to watch the shit Cherry will say on your channel. I mean, shit, Hector. Cherry fucking told your dumbass. He said, I, I'm I'm using your channel to say all this because when my channel goes back up, I'm getting my monetization back. I'm not going to say this shit over there. Any normal fucking human being would have been like, what the fuck? I'd be like, dude, what the hell? Why are you going to do it? You know, fuck you. But now nah, you're like, oh, that's okay, Jerry. Keep fucking me. I don't care. You guys are fucking something else. But again, the sides thing, I mean, that's the thing. There is definitely two sides. One side, think about it. you got one side that's never done no, you know, shit. Name it. And, and again, you know, they always talk about, you know, this and that and the lies. I love it to hear his fucking serve talk about lies and that fucking Louisiana dumbass chick talk about lies. I challenge either one of you all. Let, let's go on a panel together and talk about the lies. You show one fucking lie I said, I'll show every fucking lie you all said. How about that? Let's do it. There, there you go. No more bullshit. No more saying like, oh, they say half truths so or they're, they're trying to spin shit. No one's spinning a goddamn thing. Anybody that thinks Serb was lost at sea like that fucking stupid ass in Louisiana, you're a fucking moron. If you still think that, that's on you. I don't give a fuck. That's on you. But don't, don't sit there and say that I'm lying about it. He even fucking said it didn't happen. He's changed that story a hundred times. That wasn't him in the picture. All that fucking shit. Fuck him. He won't do that. She won't do that. We... Me and Flex tried one night when she was talking. She didn't even know the other one was doing it. We were both sitting backstage on Eric, and as soon as I popped up, you know, all of a sudden she starts saying, oh, I, I can't see nobody. I hear stuff. Dude, get the fuck out of here. And Eric, you're a fucking asshole, too, for letting that shit happen. You let the, you'll sit there and say this is a no-drama channel, and you let all the fucking drama people. Tracy's there. I mean, hell, she used your ass to fucking get her channel going, and, you know, you didn't want the drama, so she's like, oh, I'll talk about it on my channel. But when, like I said, from now on, when you all let people up there and they say stupid shit and make threats, same shit's happening. Don't ever fucking think. That's the problem. They're so used to doing shit, nothing happens back. Nobody retaliates. And even people tells them, like, oh, don't do that. Well, you're fucked up now. Like I said, when you went after Jenny and Dylan and shit, then, like, you know, Flex's channel, you know, you got a lot of people that you guys said from the fucking, uh, you call them Eli people on the Eli side, said they're losers, they're fucking weirdos and shit. Well, we'll see how you feel when Tammy's on your ass. Good luck with that, Cherry. You fucked with the wrong person this time, son. This ain't one of those people you can go back behind the scenes and kiss her ass and say shit. She's already seen your real life. See, what Cherry does, he tries to, like, talk to people with, like, oh, this is this, I'm just a character. No, man, you're a fucking human being that has no character. You're a fucking shit person along with Roy, Reese, all of you motherfuckers. 
every one of everybody on that side go fuck yourself fuck yourself two or three times a couple extra times for tomorrow too fuck all y'all rest y'all have a great night